The angels of God guard us through the night and quieten the powers of darkness. The Spirit of God be our guide to lead us to peace and to glory. It is but lost labor that we haste to rise up early and so late take rest and eat the bread of anxiety. For those beloved of God are given gifts even while they sleep. My brothers and sisters, our help is in the name of the eternal God who is making the heavens and the earth. Dear God, thank you for all that is good, for our creation and for our humanity, for the stewardship you have given us of this planet earth, for the gifts of life and of one another, for your love, which is unbounded and eternal. O thou most holy and beloved, my companion, my guide upon the way, my bright evening star. We repent the wrongs we have done. We have wounded your love. O oh God, heal us. We stumble in the darkness. Light of the world transfigure us. We forget that we are your home. Spirit of God, dwell in us. Eternal Spirit, living God, in whom we live and move and have our being. All that we are, have been, and shall be is known to you, to the very secret of our hearts and all that rises to trouble us. Living flame burn into us, cleansing wind blow through us, fountain of water well up within us, that we may love and praise in deed and truth. Eternal spirit, flow through our being and open our lips, that our mouths shall proclaim your praise. Let us worship the God of love. The Psalm for today is Psalm 31. O oh God, I have come to you for shelter. Let me never be put to shame. Deliver me in the justice of your ways. Incline your ear to me and be swift to save me. Be for me a rock of refuge, a fortress to defend me for you are my rock and my stronghold. Lead me and guide me for your namesake. Deliver me out of the net that they have laid secretly for me, for you are my strength. Into your hands I commend my spirit, for you will redeem me, eternal God of truth. The scripture reading for Thursday is from 1 John chapter 4, verses 18 to 20. There is no fear in love, but perfect love casts out fear. For fear has to do with punishment, and those who are afraid are not perfected in love. We love because God first loved us. If anyone says, I love God, and hates his brothers or sister, that person is a liar. For those who do not love their brothers and sisters whom they have seen cannot love God whom they have not seen. And we will speak the hymn. Before the ending of the day, creator of the world, we pray that you with love and lasting light would guard us through the hours of night. From all ill dreams defend our eyes, from nightly fears and fantasies. Redeem through us our evil foe that we no lasting harm may know. O wisest guide, grant all we ask. Fulfill in us your holy task. Surround us with your love and care and lead us on your life to share. 
all praise to God sustaining us, redeeming and transforming us, thanksgiving in eternity, all praise, beloved Trinity. And we'll continue with the prayers. Into your hands, O God, I commend my spirit, for you have redeemed me, O God of truth and love. Keep me, O God, as the apple of an eye. Hide me under the shadow of your wings. Preserve us, O God, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in your peace. Praise be to God. I have lived to see this day. God's promise is fulfilled and my duty done. At last you have given me peace. For I have seen with my own eyes the salvation you have prepared for all nations, a light to the world in its darkness, and the glory of your people Israel. Glory be God, sustaining, redeeming, sanctifying, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Preserve us, O God, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in your peace. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. This is the part of Compline where the Lord's Prayer is typically said, uh, but we will say the alternative, which is available in the New Zealand Book of Common Prayer. Eternal Spirit, Earth Maker, Pain Bearer, Life Giver, Source of all that is and that shall be, Father and Mother of us all, Loving God in whom is heaven, the hallowing of your name echo through the universe, the way of your justice be followed by the peoples of the world. Your heavenly will be done by all created beings. Your commonwealth of peace and freedom sustain our hope and come on earth. With the bread we need for today, feed us. In the hurts we absorb from one another, forgive us. In times of temptation and test, strengthen us. From trials too great to endure, spare us. From the grip of all that is evil, free us. For you reign in the glory of the power that is love, now and forever. Amen. I will lie down in peace and take my rest. For it is in God alone that I dwell unafraid. Let us bless the earth maker, the pain bearer, the life giver. Let us praise and exalt God above all forever. May God's name be praised beyond the furthest star, glorified and exalted above all forever. And let us say the general thanksgiving together. Eternal God, compassionate and merciful, we, your unworthy servants, give you humble thanks for all your goodness and loving kindness to us and to all people. We bless you for our creation, preservation, and all the blessings of this life, but above all for your boundless love in the redemption of the world by our Savior Jesus Christ, for the means of grace and for the hope of glory. And we pray, give us that due sense of all your mercies that our hearts may be truly thankful, and that we praise you not only with our lips, but in our lives, by giving ourselves to your service, and by walking before you in holiness and righteousness all our days. Through Jesus Christ, our Redeemer, to whom with you and the Holy Spirit be all honor and glory, now and forever. Amen. Lord, it is night. The night is for stillness. 
let us be still in the presence of God. It is night after a long day. What has been done has been done. What has not been done has not been done. Let it be. The night is dark. Let our fears of the darkness of the world and of our own lives rest in you. The night is quiet. Let the quietness of your peace enfold us, all dear to us and all who have no peace. The night heralds the dawn. Let us look expectantly to a new day, new joys, new possibilities. In your name we pray, amen. And the sentence of the day, Christ be within us to keep us, beside us to guard, before us to lead, behind us to protect, beneath us to support, and above us to bless. The divine spirit dwells in us. Thanks be to God.